Hi guys. Anyong I can't get up. Ah, uh, maganda ng hapon po. Tamad Juan here. I can't get up. I need your help to get up. I had a long day today. I thought I was finished with military, but I wasn't finished, so I had to go to my last military reserve training. My brother keeps telling me he wants to eat Korean food. His favorite is Duenjang Chige. Uh, Duenjang, Duenjang is basically a, a soybean, fermented soybean paste soup. Chige, 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 Chige is a soup, and Duenjang is the fermented soybean paste. And Gochujang is, yes, red pepper paste. In Korea, 80% of all the food, either, you know, they put gochujang or they put the red flakes, which is gochugaru. Gochujang is, jang is the, is the paste. Gochugaru is the, garu is the, is the flakes. Gochu is the dick. No, it's not dick. It's, uh, it's the red pepper. It can also mean dick, okay? So if you have, say, like, gochu, gochu, but most of the time it means, why am I so calm, sir? Lazy. I gotta introduce you to my pet and my new knife. The name of the knife would be um, Masarap. His name is Masarap. The knife's name is Masarap. <laughs> I named it. So today, a lot of you ask, like, some of you want the exact recipe of how I cook it, basic steps, but we don't really follow like a super tight recipe. We just follow like how it flows. Like we cook, we put this in, we simmer, and put the other thing in, we simmer, we taste, and then we put other things in and we simmer. That's how we kind of do our, um, that's my brother right there, do our thing, okay? Before that, I would like to introduce you to our new Masara knife! Masara knife! This guy is going to be taken care of very well. He's going to be the one who cooks everything from now on because the other knife is not working, I want to kill it. Cooking board! Cooking board, yeah. What? It's clean. We got Masarap! His name is Masarap, guys. And I'll open it. Woo! Whoa. The knife has a name. Woo! Damn sharp, guys! Wow! What the fuck? Then for Denjang, of course, the main ingredient is Denjang. Okay, so if you're in the Philippines or anywhere in the other country, there's two ways you could get this. One, you go. You ask a Korean friend, okay? You go to their house and you and then you just steal it from their mom. <laughs> the kitchen. They have it in their the yeah. fridge, for sure. If they don't have this in the, in the fridge and they call themselves Korean, they are not Korean. I'm sorry, friends. Second, you go you go to a Korean mart. There is a Korean mart everywhere. There's one in, even in Ethiopia. Okay, there's Koreans living everywhere. They're like, Korean they're like this. The nation is this small, but then they're like dispersed everywhere. Uh, which is kind of crazy, but in the Philippines, there's like a lot of Korean marts there. Just ask them for Duenjang, More they'll give you this. If you want a cheaper one, there's a smaller package, so you get a smaller one because you don't know if you might like it or not, because you might think it's shit. It might taste like shit, but it kind of tastes like stronger miso soup. Miso soup's lighter, this one has a little bit of stronger taste, but you could also always use like sugar or honey to kind of soften that kind of thick taste that if you don't like it but most Koreans like the thick thick taste especially my brother that's why we were cooking it for him you know so this is the main ingredient to enjoy, okay now side ingredients uh this one we're gonna eat off we got some radish of course radish that's a big ass radish and we got some gochukaru this is the flakes of red pepper ehoba kitty pumpkin we got some beef now like you can, like we got some uh, just ground like beef cooking for uh, soup. You can get like whatever you want, like whatever you want to put in the soup. Basically, chicken, pork, whatever is suits you. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't have to be ground beef. Usually they put ground beef, and I, I'm using this recipe by Baek Jong Won. He's a very famous Korean cook in Korea, superstar Korean cook. And we got some gochujang. <laughs> This one and this one is like the super Korean uh, pastes, okay? It's like curry for India. It's like, it's like seasick of a uh, Philippine. These are two pastes that they use in a lot. I got this because I want to make something called samjang. It's the mixture of this to show you guys how to make that and how, how we use that. But this is not going to be used in denjang, the denjang jjigae that we're going to make right now. Okay, so we're going to prepare the ingredients, guys. Just going to cut them up like this. Chup, 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 chup. And we'll see you later. So good compared to... 
compared to bullshit. Oh! No! Wait, this is this is radish, right? Do you just cook it? Do you am I supposed to? Am I supposed to wash it? You have to wash that. Every vegetable you have to wash it. What? Wash, you know? Wash it, dumbass. Guys, should I wash it? Or no? They even asked like, I mean, you... I'm listening to the subscribers right now. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> what? The moo? This is moo. Moo? 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 Wait, wash? No. <laughs> it's okay. I don't think I should wash it. Just cut it. Yeah, you won't even die because the you're gonna boil no, it this, anyway. No, this, this, you know, this, this brown shit's actually good for your no. It's it, isn't it good for your like body? Because it's like from the you won't dust. die. Is it from the dust? Like not the dust, <laughs> the soil. The soil and the soil is nutritious, so we shouldn't wash it, right? Or what? I should we should wash it? I think I think we should wash it. No, we should wash it, bro. We should wash it. Yeah. Okay, let's play back and forth. If I win, no wash. If you win, you wash. Okay. It doesn't even matter. Well, it doesn't matter. Go Jack, Jack and, and point. point. Okay, wash it. Wash it. Dumbass. Damn it. Okay, I'll wash it. I was just lazy. <laughs> also, the, also the cucumber. Also the cucumber. Wash the cucumber. I wash this! The cucumber! Don't you understand cucumber, English? You wash cucumber. You do! You wash every vegetable, dumbass. Why? Why? Because... They, Why? They're wearing their gloves and they hold the cucumber with their gloves. Yeah? And they, and they wrap it around with the gloves. I'm a dumbass. <laughs> like my brother said, I'm a dumbass. This? You sure? It is? Cut it? Yeah. Oh, cut it like that. This. That's stupid. It's more it's more easier and more faster if you cut like that and that and that. Praise God! It's Adam you bitch! Okay, so this is the radish. Mmm, mm, smells like radish! I this is my first time cutting radish in my life, guys. It was that good? Thumbs up if you like. Please comment and share and everything that you can do in your powers if you like us or if you like me or if you like anything that you see in this thing. Okay? Okay. Next. I'm gonna try to explain it a step by step for you. So maybe you could try it and fail miserably like me. <laughs> now we're gonna prepare the sauces, okay? One spoon, one big spoon. That big? Kuchujang. Oh, you also have to put kuchujang. Huh? Ban spoon. And then. Ajuman il. Get ready the sauce in one place. I'm just gonna put this in right away. We also have to put this in, which is sugar and kuchukaru. These are the sauces. Duenjang, kochujang, and smashed garlic. Smashed garlic. And then for the main ingredients, we got the mu, got some beef here, chopped kitty pumpkins. Now we head to the stove and we're gonna cook it. See you there. Let's go. Hello! Stitch here. So we're, not, we're gonna cook the denjang jjigae. It's gonna be the best jjigae. What's denjang? Soybean paste. Fermented soybean paste. And jjigae is a soup. We got this pan we always use. Actually, we bought this, but this is kind of big. It's, fr it's a fryer. Yeah, it's 5,000 won. It's cheap. If you guys are living in Korea, the best place to buy cheap, like anything, is Daiso. Daiso? Just ask where that is. You'll get anything there, like pans, pet stuff, everything like slippers and like cushions and anything like small and like you'll even get like barber shop like scissors. Cook the the beef first, okay? Beef is first. Step one, first start with the pan, heat it, and cook the beef. It can be any meat you want in the jjigae, in the soup, okay? It doesn't have to be beef, it can be chicken, whatever. Now you wanna cook it until it's kinda brownish, until it's kinda cooked. Not super cooked, but kinda cooked. Oh, step two, you put the radish when it's kind of cooked. Step two, you put the radish in. Okay, and then you kind of mix it up. Now, you see if it's kind of cooked. You tell by the way you look at me. Oh, uh, you can tell everything. Step one, you put the beef. Step two, you put the mu, the radish. And you cook it until it's kind of hard, as I thought. Step three, you put the water, like half level until like it's all filled up. Like half the pa pan, like as much as soupy you want. You put that much water in. Where's the beer? Fuck. We are not sponsored by Cast Lemon, but I wish that we were sponsored by Cast Lemon because we, it would be really hard to not get money off of this. So Cast Lemon, if you're out there, please sponsor us. I drink you 24 times a day. Yahoo! While that is preparing, I'm gonna prepare sauce for my, for my brother. I'm gonna prepare Samjang sauce, guys. What the fuck are you doing, bro? I'm naked! Doesn't matter. Hi guys, I, I'm gonna cook samjang. I'm naked! I'm gonna make samjang for- No, not like that! That! You messed it up! What do you mean I messed it this up? This is for your fucking face when you fucking put it for your pimples no. like that! Tajin butter. You don't get it. Shake it, shake it. Woo! My 
brother. It's almost done. It's already done? It's almost it's done. It's so easy to make. How's it taste like? Mm. I don't like your um, reaction, bro. I think you put too much water, right? Oh, I thought the only thing was missing. Taste test, guys. Taste test. Honest. Mmm. Very mm. pudro. It's, it's not like the restaurant's tenure chicken. It's like very salty. Don't put, don't put. It's good. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Our dinner chicken is complete. I'll show it to you. Yep. That's what it is. Soybean soup. Our own soybean soup. And we're gonna put it down. Hi guys, my name is Locke and I'm back again with the, my brother's cooking show. And my brother cooked me Teng Teng Chige for the first time. I love Teng Teng Chige because it's one of my favorite Korean food. Whenever I get hungry, I eat Teng Teng Chige. So here we go. Whoa! Mm, the visual, it doesn't look that good. It, uh, yeah. The visual, mm, but let's see about the taste. Okay, here we go guys. The taste of the Teng Teng Chige my brother made. Soybean paste. The taste is like. It's so different from restaurant and the chige. Restaurant soybean paste too, because in the restaurant soybean paste too, it's very salty. And they add like a lot of MSG. But this one, it's homemade tengu chige. That means that there is no MSG that the people put in the tengu chige. So it's more healthier, it's more better for your body, and it's just so good. I call this like the healthy, healthier tengu chige. Because there's no MSG whatsoever. Zero. Guys, hi guys. Mmm, I'm ah, so stressed out. Try it, try it. Very juicy. Uh. Mm. Mm. The beef in itself is actually pretty good. This is samjang. Can you see it? Explain it to her. How do you make it? Samjang is you mix tenya chige, the soybean paste, with kochujang, the red bean paste. Two one, right? What's mm. two? The soybean or the tenya? Uh, the tenya chige is two, so you put two spoons. Red chili paste, you put one. One spoon. You mix it and you put honey and then you put uh, sesame oil and honey and garlic also. Smash garlic, right? Smash garlic. Yeah, and you just mix it, mix it, shake, 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 and it's gonna be like this. But the is good, tenjang, bro. It's not bad, tenjang. How many stars? I'll give this uh, 8.1. Because one, you know why I, did? I didn't give it that high? One, because of <coughs> the visual. Two, we just we forgot tofu, maybe that's why the taste is not that good. But it's good. So, so guys, I finally found the holy grail. The one that makes the tenjang chige, the taste, is the tenjang itself. So, so us we use like the really homemade denjang, but in the restaurants they use some kind of different denjang. They made it theirself, denjang, or they bought it like somewhere else, like a really really like a good denjang. To make denjang, it, you need preservation, like three months in a big pot, right? It tastes all different. Like one month denjang, two months denjang, five months, one year denjang, it all tastes different. Depends on the preservation like of the denjang. What are you gonna rate this? I give it 8.1. I think like. 7.5 because it's kind of bland, but mm -hmm. I like I like it that not bland. Ah, hey guys, share the love, share the love, please. Here we go. So maki, maki, maki. Chaba. Chaba. Go go go.